Evolution the Grand Experiment is basically my personal uh, desire to search out if evolution is true or not. I've been trying to figure this out since a college bet when a friend bet me if I could prove evolution one way or the other. And initially I took it on as an avocation uh, as I was still working as a physician. But since then, around 12 years ago, my wife and I uh, started up a television production company and with the sole purpose of trying to solve the theory of evolution. Is it true? Is it not? What are the problems? We went around the world, went to think seven countries, and interviewed the top scientists at the top museums like Chicago Field Museum, Melbourne Museum, et cetera. And um, we also then gained access to the dig sites and interviewed the scientists at the dinosaur and the human dig sites to just basically review the theory of evolution, make sure something wasn't being missed, to get some more basic information uh, that I could judge evolution by as a scientist. In the course of this project, which was supposed to be just a one-year project, um, we ended up traveling over 100,000 miles, many, many more miles than Darwin ever traveled. And we, we went to, I think, three continents and seven countries. and um, we, we logged more time on the road than you could ever imagine for this project. It's probably one of the longest documentaries that have ever been filmed. It took 12 years to film and uh, you'll see the quality of it in all these videos because th we just have some spectacular video footage that my wife took. The enormity of this project is mind-boggling. For example, the photographs. My wife took 60 thousand photographs for this project over the course of these 12 years. Also, we have interviews you know, with these 60 scientists. They're all typed out, 1,000 pages, single space typed pages. And um, the videos, we have like 300 videotapes of interviews and dig site shots and all this. And um, it's mind-boggling. <laughs> the amount of organization it took to put this project together, it's just mind-boggling.